Hey there, so today what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to use the iView ISD100 video doorbell with an existing doorbell power line. So what you're going to first do is make sure that your doorbell is not connected to the bottom power bank. So you just want the doorbell to be a little square like this with the um, power port exposed, okay? So now what you're going to do is remove the metal plating from the back of the doorbell so it's just like this, okay? And inside your doorbell, you should have received um, two packages. So this one has the little screws in it. And this one is actually the most important one. It has these tiny little screws, has a reset button, and you should have received a little port thingy like this. It's a little plastic, and this is what we use to connect your doorbell wires with our doorbell wires. Okay, so first what you have to do is there's going to be two parts of the wires that come with your doorbell. There's going to be one end that has little circles and there's going to be one end that are just wires. The red part is the plus and then the black part is the minus. So what you're going to do is you're going to take the wires that do not have the little holes at the end. You're going to take this plastic port that comes with your doorbell. You're going to gently squeeze each one thread the doorbell wire in. I know it's a little hard to see. Okay, so you're gonna squeeze that, thread the wire in there. This way it's like this, okay? Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this bag that has the little reset line in there and there's little two little tiny screws. Okay, you're gonna take the screws out and you're going to follow these instructions. So there's a plus and the minus. So the red one is the plus, the black is the minus. You're going to line each one up with the little hole and you're gonna place the tiny, the two little tiny black screws. You're gonna screw it in there so these are securely, um, secured to the doorbell. Oh, let me screw them in for, is it recording? Okay. All right, and then what you're gonna do, it's gonna look like this. You're gonna put the little tiny screw inside the hole you're gonna, oops, line it up with the other hole and you're gonna screw it in. So once you have the screws properly in place, it will look like this with the plus and the minus in the screwed in the right direction. And now basically all you need to do is you just need to take each end. So here's the plus, here's the minus. Now you need to take your existing doorbell wire, just squeeze that, put the plus in the plus port, and then put the minus wire in the minus port, and then your doorbell should have power at that point. After your doorbell has power, just follow the other steps to set up your doorbell with your uh, phone's camera, your phone's app, with the iView iHome app, and you'll be all set. Thanks for watching.